Hello and welcome back to another beer review. I'm Pepper Beer Lad and today I'm going to be doing a vocation beer. This one is a collaboration with Two from Claw. It's called In Cahoots and it's a Belgian IPA at 7%. It says all that right there. This one I got from the vocation website. It's part of the tasting bundle. Um, it comes with this, a stout and a sour. Um, I think I've already done the stout. I think it was the biscotti one. Uh, the sour I've got in the back somewhere, I think it's in the fridge, um, and there's this one, there's two of each, and I've kind of been looking forward to these. A bit of guff on the back, it says, enter the world of Tooth and Claw, where modern meets traditional in the form of a Belgian IPA. Its deep orange colour complements the layers of earthy flavours, uh, while the hops lend notes of pine, lemongrass, herbal tea, and a subtle hint of vanilla. Smooth in texture with a noticeable bitterness, balanced out by the spicy and fruity aromas. It says that there. And that is the bottle art. It's the what's that? Beige, brownish colour. Um, with what looks like a lion. And there's the cap. Let's crack it open, shall we? And see what we've got. Unfortunately, the uh, tasting bundle didn't come with the tasting glass. This one I had to have myself. Um, but there's the beer. We've got, like it said, golden copper beer. Nice white little head. Um, it looks nice. Let's get a smell show and see what we get. Ooh, you can smell that lemongrass. It's got a nice piney smell to it as well. This smells like something I had recently. What did I have recently that smelled like this? I don't know, it'll come to me. It smells nice. Let's get a mouthful for body and car. Uh, carbonation's really light, body I'm going to say medium at push, light medium, so really close to medium bodied. So far, so good. Let's get a big old taste, shall we? Jeez. Bitter. <clears throat> so far, it tastes like an expensive lager. I mean, really expensive lager. Doesn't have any IPA sort of flavours to it. Um, look, lemongrass isn't as strong in the flavour as it is in the smell. Doesn't It doesn't taste like this drink I had recently. I can't remember what it was. Uh, anyway, um, it smelt like it, but it did, I can't taste lemongrass. Um, there's hoppy flavours to it, but it's, it's more malty. So I think it tastes like expensive lager. What does that taste like? It tastes along the lines of the beer Moretti or... Oh, what? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'm going to say beer Moretti. It tastes along the lines of beer Moretti. Don't know why. It doesn't taste vanilla. What's it say? Vanilla, pine. I can taste pine. I can actually taste pine. Um, it says fruity, spicy, um, hints of vanilla, herbal tea, lemongrass, um, pine. I can't taste the lemongrass. Can't taste the herbal tea. Can't actually, no. I can taste the herbal tea. I can't taste the vanilla. Can't taste the fruit. Spicy, no, but I can see what they mean. It is bitter though. Um, deep orange colour, earthy flavours, yeah. Hops lend notes to pine, kind of. Lemongrass, no. Herbal tea, a little bit. Vanilla, no. Bitter, yes. Balanced out with spicy and fruity aromas. It smells spicy and fruity, but it doesn't. It smells like lemongrass. 
that is all sorts of weird not weird but I've been promised one thing but given a complete different but it's not bad this what I've been given I don't know it's like I say it tastes like beer Marathi and if you've had beer Marathi you know what it tastes like it tastes like expensive lager I don't know um I guess I'm gonna go away and in, not I don't know if I enjoy it or not that's the thing I can't figure out it's not what I expected it to be. I expect it to be something else. I expect it to be what it says on the bottle, because vocation is good with what they say on the bottle. But it's not. Just wash that out. It's also got a really, really metallic aftertaste. This is not as good as Vocation can do. Yeah, I'm going to go away and finish this because I've spent money on it. So, um, Vocation and Tooth and Claws in Cahoots, Belgian IPA, out of 10. I didn't think I'd score a Vocation this low, but I'm going to give it a 4. It's just, it's, pardon me, not that good. <coughs> it isn't. Um. It tastes like something I could get from the shops or from the pub um, for cheaper than I bought it. So, if you have had this before, please let me know. Let me know what you think, if you like it, if you don't. If you've not had it, I'll leave a link to Vocation's website down below where you can pick one up um, or you can buy the tasting bundle because, I don't know, it's down to you. Um, if you like the video though, thumbs up, thumbs down. All that usual stuff, if you want to subscribe, consider doing so, because the show must go on, etc, etc, so on and so forth, and I'll see you later. Bye.